For sticking on the hardcore for our Athlete of the Week, you may have heard of Oregon City's Taryn Bradford for his football highlights, but the basketball court is where Taryn has truly come into his own. Check it out. The younger brother of Beavers receiver Trayvon Bradford, Taryn's used to being compared to his big bro. Throughout football, I was always like, just like behind him, so I would be referred to him as like his younger brother all the time. If coach wanted to talk to me, it'd be Trayvon's younger brother or something like that. Trayvon is a naturally vocal leader. My brother's a really raw, raw type of guy. He's a be in your face, really scream at you type of guy. Taryn is more of a quiet leader. Taryn is the consummate humble warrior. He's a player who is always the same, whether he's having a good game or not having his best game. Uh, he's always great with his teammates. His point guard style, emulating the likes of Blazers Damian Lillard or the Rockets Chris Paul on the court. I gotta just be like the most vocal leader out there. I'm not getting known to like use my voice. I try to like lead by example, but so that's just difficult for me. While they have different styles, certain traits just come with being a Bradford. What is it like growing up with such a close knit and athletic family? Was it very competitive? Did you? Have extremely competitive. It's easy to compare the brothers, but Taryn's talent is more than capable of standing on its own. He's the kind of kid who has that idea of continual growth. He's, he's constantly trying to get better. I've watched that over the period of four years, and that's why certainly his future as a collegiate athlete um, has got to have somebody salivating, whether football or basketball, because he's always trying to get better. As the only returning starter, Bradford has big plans to lead a young but passionate Pioneers hoop squad all the way to the child center. Potential that the younger guys have on our team is just ridiculous. We're definitely the most talented group of people we've had in here. The two sport athlete is being recruited by both Oregon and Oregon State, along with a handful of other Division I schools. Taryn says his brother is pulling for the Beavs. I'm pretty sure he personally wants me to come down there and play with them. He just thinks that'd be super cool. Now, Terrence still working out which sport and where he's going to play next year. He says he would love to play with his bro, but if he somehow ends up in Eugene, there could be some awkward family dinners in that competitive family. Jonathan Smith and Mike Riley were actually at Oregon City yesterday talking with Terrence, so it'll be fun to see which hat he picks up in February. Now, if you want to nominate an athlete of the week, don't forget to send me a message. You can email me at ajmccord at coin.com or tweet me. That's aj underscore mccord. And, of course, be sure to join us every Sunday for Game On. We'll break down your week in sports. Big game for the Seahawks this weekend. That's Sundays at 1130 following Coin 6 News at 11.